In this video, we are going to take a quick look at Apple's Air Quick Look feature. I've already embedded a USDZ file which contains a 3D text object that I've created using an online 3D design tool called Vectory. I will leave a link uh, to it in the description of this video below. Now that the required HTML code is embedded in my page, I can see the preview thumbnail of the object which is linked to the USDZ file that resides on Vectory servers. I could alternatively host it on my blog instead. The vector icon of the cube shows us that this is a USDZ file. This file can be viewed using USDZ supported iOS apps like Messages, Safari, Mail and others. Now all you need to do is to click the link to the file. Safari automatically detects that this is a USDZ file and launches Air Quick Look Viewer. The first thing you see is a standard view of the 3D object that was downloaded into your device. To view the content in augmented reality, you will need an AirKit compatible device running iOS 12. Now I click the Air button to initialize the augmented reality view. The camera stream starts and a semi-transparent view of the object appears on top of the camera feed. Shortly after, AirKit quickly detects a surface and places the 3D object on top of it. You can now rotate, move, and scale the object as you find fit. It's an amazing technology that makes sharing 3D content easy, very easy, over the web. If you own an AirKit enabled device running iOS 12, you can try it yourself. I put a link in the description to the same page I used for this demonstration, so make sure you check it out. Thank you, and see you on the next video.